Cove to Coast Marine, your local family-owned boat dealership, presents this Creval 26. It takes everything you love about the Creval 24 and adds more room, features, and power. The Creval 26 is ideal for fishermen who want the flexibility of a family boat. This 26-foot center console boat performs flawlessly, whether it's on the river, lake, inshore, or offshore fishing trips. Let's take a look inside. Evans will tell us more about this great boat from Creval. Hey guys, I'm Evans Baird with Cove 2 Coast Marine. And today we're in Savannah, Georgia in our showroom inside here. And we are gonna talk about the 2023 Creval 26 that we just received. This boat is powered with a Mercury 400, the new V10. This can be around a 60 mile per hour boat. It's got the 12 inch hydraulic jack plate back there. Show them that jack plate. That's gonna come on this boat. So back here at the stern, um, you got a rear bench seat here in the middle. So lots of seating. The cooler underneath here as well. This actually pops open right here at this latch. You get to your cooler and then your bill jack says and pumps and you're back there behind that wall. So easy to get to your pumps and everything you need to get to. On both sides, back here in the back, you have two big live wells. Super nice live wells. You got your standpipe up on the top here. And this boat does have three live well standards. You have two back here in the back and one in front of the console. So back here behind the linen post, I like how you have a lot of space to walk around. Um, cutting board comes standard, as well as a freshwater sink. So there's a freshwater sink here. So you got a freshwater hose that comes out here as well, as well as a little swim up cooler. Back on the swim platform and four step ladder. So coming back to here, you got a cooler slide underneath here as well. It slides out, goes back in place, as well as four tackle boxes, storage, and our storage box here as well. On both sides, port and starboard of the boat, you have rod holders in the gunnels. So going down the highway and interstate, it's nice to have a place to put your rods in. Coming standard on this boat are four rod holders behind the landing post, as well as four on the T-top, and then you have two king-style rod holders on each side of the T-top. This boat is equipped with spreader lights and the mister system back here. So on a hot summer day, you got some fresh water coming down on you, keeping you cool. Um, I love the distance on this helm. So you're not super, feel like your knees are hitting anything. You got plenty of space here with flip up bolsters as well. Coming down as well as your flip up armrest on either side, as well as in the middle of the boat with a nice little touch with cup holders in the middle there as well. So at the helm, there's a lot to go over here, but you got your Simrad NSS 12 inch unit. So everything is integrated, your pumps, the live wells are all integrated into your Simrad, which is very convenient. Uh, you got your jack plate to the left of the steering wheel, obviously hydraulic and tilt steering. JL audio system. This boat is very loud. It's got four speakers in the T-top, two up front as well as your sub. Um, sounds really good, really loud. Cup holders, your trim tabs over here to the right, your throttle. This boat does hold nine people, as well as it has a 90 gallon fuel tank on this boat. The new Cravals come with this three-sided windshield going up to the T-top, which is super nice, as well as a nice little touch for a um, wireless phone charger here. So that comes in very handy. Um, moving up to the bow of this boat, you can see the forward seating cushions up front. We have placed here, I'll take them off in a second. We can show you the storage on either side of the casting deck. In front of your console here, you have a big seat that can comfortably fit two people, as well as a live well slash plugging it for a cooler if you just wanna put your drinks up front as well and save you from having to walk to the back of the boat. This boat does come pre-wired for a trolling motor for the bow and your wirings are gonna run down here is where your batteries will be located. 
as well as an already mounted trolling motor charger where you can see it is marked right here for you charge your trolling motor. So now we'll take a quick break and get these cushions off. It's magic, the cushions are off. So now up front, you can see the full casting deck here. So comfortably three people up front fishing. Plenty of cup holders as you can tell. Your fresh water tanks over here, it holds 20 gallons. As well, I didn't mention these Fender Pros. We show them on either side, but the cleats are super nice in these boats to tie your bumpers off to. So you can just clip your bumpers right there on both sides, and that way it saves you from having to tie it around the cleat every time you go up the dock. So both sides have huge rod holder storage, as well as a great spot for beach bags and all your gear for the sandbar. Same thing on this side. So you can get a look in there. Fully gel coated, super thick boxes here so you don't get that flex and give and walk on them. And here in the middle, it's a great spot for a cast net as well as more storage. There is a panel you can open up right there on the left side of that box and actually fit more stuff through into your rod holder box. And then might as well put one more up front. This is a great spot for dock lines, bumpers as well. And then obviously up front here, you're gonna have your full anchor locker, which comes equipped with an anchor as well. Rod holders up here in the front as well. So thank you all for watching. Um, come down to Cove to Coast Marine and check out this Caval 26.